Hello YouTube, it's 4.30 in the morning and I'm out checking my lines. Still waiting for that maple syrup to come up to temperature. Or maple water, I should say. It's not anywhere near syrup. I just started that batch tonight. I was demonstrating my automatic switch I installed to shut off the water so I don't let it overflow again. Everything's looking pretty good. No major leaks. Uh, the top tree up there, early bird, the first one we looked at, it had a little leak on it, but I think I fixed that. I remember to turn my phone sideways for this video. It's kind of chilly out. You can see my breath. Now here's a leak. But I didn't cause that one. This tree has a little bit of a uh, infection. It's a heart rot that will eventually ruin the tree. Yeah, it's not ready to offload yet. So yeah, I'm basically just wasting time out here making this YouTube video for you guys while I warm up my maple water and kill any yeasts or fungus that started to grow in it. It's been pretty warm out. My cold storage room got a little warm and I don't want it to compromise any of my water. So I figure if I'm going to be out here wasting time, I might as well make a YouTube video. You just saw the south driveway. Everything's pretty good with it. It is 4.30 in the morning, so I'm kind of uh, saying that I'm making a YouTube video in all the different directions of my neighbors. <laughs> but they've lived long, along with me for over 10 years now they know that I'm kind of crazy no mail still waiting for my new crocs to be delivered I stuck them in the dryer a little too long trying to shrink them down can't even fit them on my feet. So I'm actually wearing real shoes. That north driveway isn't ready to offload yet either. These pumps have been running every time I walk outside. I've heard the pumps running tonight, so just thought I'd come and give them a check. Guys, probably what's that nut doing out there? <clears throat> Anytime it gets hot or cold, you got to check your lines, and that's the best way to get a good maple run. It's warm in the day and cold at night, like this. This is the third run that I've seen this year. The last two runs gave me about eight gallons until I was done filtering. This tree's not too happy. I uh, put an anchor in it. It doesn't seem to be very happy about it. But it'll heal up. I 
This is my largest tree. So yeah, that's pretty much it. Everything looks pretty good except for that one tap that was coming loose and uh, hopefully this water is up to temperature and I can finally go to bed tonight. Not yet, about 110. So yeah, I'm gonna bring that up to about 160 before I go to sleep. That way I know that I've killed any yeast that were in it. I just shut off the propane. All right, well, I'm going to sign off because I'm probably just rambling like an idiot at this point. Good night.